Welcome to our tutorial on optimizing your gaming experience with LD Player. LD Player is a renowned Android emulator that lets you play your favorite mobile games on a PC, offering enhanced graphics and control. Proper window arrangement is key for managing multiple games or applications simultaneously, ensuring smooth performance and ease of use. Today, we'll guide you through the player's window arrangement feature, which is crucial for multitasking and could significantly impact your gameplay efficiency. Stay tuned to learn how to streamline your virtual Android environment for optimal gaming. Please don't forget to subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up and hit that bell icon for notifications. Open your LD multiplayer. On the bottom left, you will see an optimization. Here, you'll find a slider to adjust the frames per second FPS, which influences the performance of each instance. Lowering the FPS can enable you to run more instances simultaneously, whereas a higher FPS setting may provide a smoother experience but limit the number of simultaneous instances. For more instances, lower the FPS. Higher FPS improves visuals but uses more PC resources, quickly reaching limits. To free up more memory for new instances. Enable memory optimization to use less memory and graphics memory. Allowing you to start more instances. In the virtual disk mode. Choose high speed if you're not using an SSD to enhance performance. For SSDs, select stable to lower the risk of file damage. The last option saves disk space when running multiple instances. Automatic arrangement settings. Preferences for how multiple windows are arranged on the screen. Either in a grid or diagonally, including auto resizing and restrictions on window placement. and batch operations. Adjust the start interval in seconds for launching instances. Alter the number of new instances created and existing ones cloned in batch processing. In other settings, enable the option to remember the positions of all instance windows. For instance, if you want LD player to open in the upper left corner of your screen, move it there and select this option. LD player will then open in the same position next time. Please don't forget to subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up and hit that bell icon for notifications. This way, you can easily find this video again when you want to use the LD Player function. That wraps up our quick tutorial for today.